During quarantine, I taught myself ZBrush. Being shut down and locked up. You know, after some time, I, I, I did a lot of different things around the house, which I built myself a shed to work in. But during that time, I also stood in my garage and I was like, I have this huge space. And I have a lot of stuff in it, which includes my tools. My tools are now home. My tools are all home because I have no place to put them, I have no job. <laughs> and that means all the tools of my trade are at my disposal at my home. So now it's time to make them, make them make money for me without going through someone else to do it. Start my own business, make my own money from home. Why do I need to go somewhere when I have all the tools that I need to do what I do, do what I want to do um, at home? I didn't like the job that I had anyway, number one. I did it because it paid the bills, so now it, I don't have an option to do that job anymore because I don't want to do it. So how do I make that money with what I have at home, the knowledge that I've gained, the passion that I have for to do what I want to do to get it out to the people that I know that are going to want it. That's what I've done, is combine all of my skills into a purposeful direction. It's really exciting to get back into art, making things that I like. I've always loved dragon. That's how I was when I was a kid. That's how my son is. He's into dragon books right now and he can't stop talking about them. It, and I would find miniatures of dragons and I'd print them out. I'd print a bunch of them. I got tons of them around here. It's stuff that other people have made because I thought they were cool. That's why I bought 3D printers. I want to make what's in my head. I want to make it materialize in 3D and give it to everybody who loves that the same kind of stuff.